Hello everyone, I know it's been a little bit since I've last updated. Um, I've just been really busy. Today is not going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I'm going to show you um, what I'm packing down to the beach for my small dog here. So in this big zipper, I'm bringing down this Frisbee. Um, I know it's ginormous compared to her little body, but she will not play with small Frisbees. She wants the big ones. So I'm bringing that down for her. And then I've got two toys for her, a little monkey, brand new toy. And then I'm also bringing down one of her favorite toys in the world. You want that? No? Okay. Um, and then I also have two bowls, one for food and one for water. And yes, they are meant for cats, but um, she's a small dog and they're easy to pack away. So, um, food and water. And then I have a little um, travel water bottle. Um, the car ride is going to be about six to seven hours, so I'm going to keep this up front with me. Um, and then also for the um, walks on the beach. And then I have um, this little poop bag holder. Her leash is not in here because I will be using it, um, so it's not in the bag currently. But I do have this. Pick up your dog's poop, people. <laughs> Um, and then we're going down for 4th of July, so she has this cute little dress. And look, I don't usually dress my dog up, but it's 4th of July. It's cute. Why not? And then it does get cold down at the beach, um, even in summer. So I have this little, um, jammies for her. And I don't know if she's going to wear this or not. It just depends on how cold it is where we are. And then her jacket for when we go down to the beach. Um, she would not be sleeping in this one or anything. This would just be for when we're walking down. If it's rainy, windy, or cold. She's a small dog, guys. So that's all that is going to be in this big pocket. Oh, this does go in there as well. Um, I just took it out so you could see inside of it. It's just a fan, and that's just in case if it's really hot where she'll be sleeping. Um, I just want to be able to set it up for her if it's too hot and I can't control the temperature in there. I don't think I'll have a problem with the heat, but I think it's better to be prepared than not at all. So in this front jacket uh, pocket, one second, I'm going to open it. Um, I have her dog food, and we're only going down for, we're heading down for one night, two mornings. Okay, so two nights and two mornings. So this will be more than enough for her. Um, yeah, it's only for like... Tomorrow, the uh, uh, third, which is tomorrow, and the fourth and the fifth. So yeah, only yeah, this is gonna be plenty. And then I have some of her chewies and her treats. And then this is just an extra long um, leash that you hook into the ground here. And I'm bringing this just because I'm not quite sure what the setup will look like outside. I know they have a fence in area, but she's a small dog. Um, and if I'm not with her, I just, I'm paranoid. So I want to bring it just in case if I don't think the backyard is going to be secured enough. So that's all for the bag. I will be bringing down her bed and then a little tent for her to sleep in, um, depending on the setup of the house and, um, a blanket for her. And, um, yeah, that's about it. So this is just a short little video of what's in my dog's bag for the beach.